let's unbox a new Praying Mantis. Hello, my name's Stuart Wood and welcome to this unboxing video of a new Praying Mantis. Now, for anyone who watched the Praying Mantis standoff video up top here, okay, you will know that during that video, I had a new Praying Mantis get delivered. So that is what we are going to unbox today. Okay, so I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce the name of this Praying Mantis because you know I'm not good at doing that. I'll put it on the screen now. So I've had this Praying Mantis from Exo Factory. They are a supplier in Europe. So he's been on a long journey. So I've just finished recording the Praying Mantis standoff video, which is when this guy got delivered. And that's why I'm not on my usual unboxing table, okay? Because I don't want to have this Praying Mantis waiting too long because I've got the lights, they have to be moved, I have to set the table up. So I'm just gonna unbox it here right now. So this Praying Mantis, the name of it is on the screen now. I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce that Praying Mantis. Now let's get this guy unboxed. Let's see what a gorgeous guy this is. Now it is advertised as a pink mantis. I'm not expecting it to actually be pink. We like them blue tarantulas that you get, but half the time they're not bloody blue. Okay, so the good news is he is alive. He's alive and well. Okay. Put that to one side. And he is small. It's the only problem having small mantis. I have to use fruit ploys again. Anyway, let's get him out. And from the images I've seen of these ones, these ones are gorgeous. They look like aliens. Let's see if I can get him out. I don't want to disturb him too much. Okay. Let's have a look, fella. Where are you? Okay, so indeed he isn't pink. Well, from the look of it, he's molted during shipment. You can see here, if I can just show you there on the camera. See there, which is going to focus. Let's get this fella out. Let's see how friendly he is. I'm always very nervous when I get a new mantis because I never know how friendly they're going to be. Yep, he's coming. He's coming. There we go. There he is. Now I know you can't see very good because the uh, the video camera is not going to pick up this little fella. He's very small. Okay. But he is going to feature in some of my videos. Now I'm going to put up a couple of images of him. Okay. I'll see if I can get some B-roll of him if I can. I'm going to put that up now, some B-roll of him. And he's not pink. He's like a brownie colour. So I'm assuming he'll turn pink when he becomes an adult. I will have to look into that. However, he's a very gorgeous looking little chappy. And we already have an enclosure ready for him. So in this enclosure... It's just a deli cup with a hole in the top. There's a little bit of mesh. Okay, I have some substrate at the bottom. Some sticks. I have a stick at the top for him to hang on to if he wishes to. And we have some kitchen towel. Now the kitchen toweling is to spray on. Okay, now he has been in a hell of a shipment. He's been on a hell of a journey. He's come from Europe. All of the fruit flies are dead. So he might be a bit hungry. So immediately after this video, I'm going to hop out, get some fruit flies for this little fella. Right, so all i got to do here, excuse my nipples, is the very first important thing we need to do is to wet his enclosure. I'm then going to allow him to come onto this stick. Actually, no, I'm going to put him down here because then he knows where the water is. There he is. Go on then, Kurt. There we go. Okay. Put the lid on. And now I'm going to leave him for around 48 hours before I do any photography. We are going to be photographing him next, okay? Have you noticed how we're doing a lot of praying mantises? Last year we was doing a lot. Oh, look at he's having a drink. So he's thirsty. He's thirsty because his towel, his kitchen towel that he shipped in is dry. So he's thirsty. But... Excel factory delivered it. It's on time. It's on the predicted time of when they said, and he's also alive. Back to what I was saying, we are going to be photographing next. A lot of praying mantises, and I think 
what we could do is we could call this year the the year of the praying mantises last year it was the year of the jumping spiders this year it's the year of the praying mantises so i wonder what we're going to be doing next year because you know, as as the year go on and the seasons go on we are going to be changing things up on the channel again name is on the screen i'm not even going to pronounce i'm not even going to try to pronounce that because i will screw it up and you guys will just laugh at me in the comments i'm not even going to try that but he is alive and well i'm going to place him up here he will sit next to my spiny flower mantis we're going to be photographing him next again i'm going to let him settle in for a couple of days and then we are going to photograph that little guy so i hope you enjoyed this unboxing video of my new praying mantis again check out exo factory the link to their website will be in the description below my name's stuart wood i want to thank you for getting to the end of this video and as always i'll see you on the next one now what the hell is this praying mantis called keep it recording keep it recording we'll just delete it out perfectly okay again check out exo terror